Today we're gonna take a look at Reillusion's new AI Smart Search. Here's the thing. The new Smart Search feature is a great way to save time and find exactly what you want between countless models, motions, and all different types of assets, thus making your work much easier. But why is this search feature a big deal? And why is it different from simply browsing the content manager inside Character Creator or iClone for that matter? Well, for starters, Smart Search is AI powered, which means it uses artificial intelligence to help you find the assets that you need. You see, finding the stuff you have in your project is one thing, but rummaging through a huge library of assets just to find that one table, bed sheet, motion, or material that you need, that's got to be somewhat tedious. And this new feature is trying to fix that by offering an easy way to look things up. And for transparency, this video is brought to you by Reillusion. This new feature is divided into two functions, Deep Search and Keyword Search. You can find the new Smart Search window in multiple places. On the toolbar, there is a new convenient Smart Search bar, and you can find it under the Window drop-down menu and next to the Content Manager search bar. Deep Search allows for text search, image search, and to find similar items. Also, Deep Search can take text input like simple descriptions or keywords and tags. The result is a list of assets, and these results are divided into multiple categories and even subcategories. You can switch between the pack and item tabs if you only need solo items, and you can also do so by name tag and description of course, but you can also search based on author or developers and exclude unwanted results by using the exclude field. Deep search can also be used with more than a hundred plus languages. So if English isn't your language of choice, you can use your native language. Furthermore, the image input is a great option, sometimes even better than the text description. A picture is better than thousand words after all. You can drag and drop images from your browser or your computer to the image input field. Or you can just take a screenshot using the Windows key plus Shift plus S and paste it directly into the image input. The search algorithm will scour the Reillusion system, which includes the Marketplace, Content Store, and ActorCore, and it will get you exactly what you want within the app. That's right. So all the search, downloading, and even somewhat purchases can be done inside the app. You can download stuff that you already purchased, or you can download assets that you like under trial. But how do you know an asset is on trial? Well, there is a big trial tag under the assets. Also, when you add it to your scene, a big watermark will appear until you buy the asset. You can see the trial assets under Scene Manager denoted in purple. There is also an option under the Help menu to view and purchase items. I think this can be beneficial the most to people who use a lot of assets to build scenes for ArcViz, groundwork, interior design, in addition to architects, and people who need to iterate between multiple designs quickly without having to waste too much time on the search, download, and import process. A good example is find a similar option. Here, you can select any asset in your scene, right-click it, and pick Deep Search Similar. This will bring up all similar assets, which you can replace by just dragging and dropping on any asset. Next is Keyword Search, which as the name suggests, does a text search based on tags, author names, and can find a motion among thousands of actor core animations. You can right-click any animation and inspect information where you can see all the tags and author information. This is a great feature, even for artists and developers looking to showcase their work in the Reillusion library. Using good descriptions, tags, and overall information for keyword search and the right thumbnail design for deep search and image search is a great way to ensure that your work can be found easily. The rest is as easy as dragging and dropping any animation or assets on your character and the asset is applied automatically. Now let's see how this smart search feature can help you work fast with an example. Fire up iClone from the Reillusion Hub, make sure you are using the latest version. Then let's drop a character into a scene and pick some clothes from the library. Like I said, Deep Search allows you to find assets by description. So I will search for the keywords sweater and man. To apply the asset, simply drag and drop it into your character. For the pants, I will drag and drop an image for jeans into the image search field. This will pull up all similar items in the search results. Again, applying them is as simple as dragging and dropping them onto your character. You can also grab screenshots directly from the library or you can do that online. Like this hairstyle, without even saving the image. Just use Windows plus Shift plus S 
to take a screenshot, then hit Ctrl V to paste it. And this will save you a ton of time when trying to find the exact asset that you will need. And this works for animations too. Searching for keywords like sitting and couch will bring up all the relevant animations. And the smart search system makes it incredibly easy to find and edit your projects by helping you pick exactly what you're looking for. Now, all this is good and dandy, and I truly do like the added functionality. But as you might have guessed, there is a but incoming. So here it is. My only gripe with this new feature is that it only serves a resolutions ecosystem. For example, if you could expand the search for other marketplaces, I mean on the internet, and have that option, this would be an ultimate tool. But it might not be technically possible. I'm just trying to throw things at the wall and hoping that something will stick. Other than that, it is a great feature. You can check out Reillusion and the Smart Search announcement page by following the first link in the description down below. And there you have it guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.